I'm back. Did you miss me? I hope so. I missed you. Okay. I got my little goofy self here again. All right. I put on some bling. Got my bracelets going on. I got my necklaces going on. Finally got that one undone. So um, I'll probably put it on a looser, another one to come down just a little bit more. It's got, it, it's kind of a, you know, it's one that's not going to be very long. And I might pull my little cross up about up to here when I get ready to go out. So, but anyways, <coughs> hold on, drink. Oh, I still, my eyes is still frozen. <laughs> I don't know how else to do it. I love those cups. Okay, anyways, let's continue. Oh, I'm Amy. Welcome to Amy's Little Bit of Everything. Around here, oh yeah, and I got my earrings in too, guys. Around here, we do a little bit of anything and everything. Um... And you know, it's a, uh, leave a comment, whether it's good or bad. If it's bad, I'll handle it. I'm 56. I've been around the block a time or two. Yeah, it might, you know, get me right here in the heart a little bit, but I'll pull through. I usually do. Okay, let's get moving on. Get rid of that stupid stuff that I got to spill out there. All right, guess what this is? No, it's not to make music. Okay. Um, it is a convenient stainless steel meatball clip. Okay, that's what it says. All right. You can even do fish ball, rice balls, um, but you can make your meatballs. Um, it's a little off balance. I hate to push it over because I'm scared I'm going to break it, but hey. Um, I mean, usually I make the old-fashioned meatball, you know, just rolling around like that. But I'm going to try it with this. I'm going to make my little meatball, stick it in there, and then they'll be perfect, perfectly round. i got to get that straightened up, though. That's driving me crazy. I don't want to break it. Man, it may not be able to. It might be in the... I may have to have Jeff do it. Yeah, it's just a little bit off balance. I don't ever want to break anything. I mean, it's not that big of a deal. Just a little bit. Um, I might just have see if Jeff can straighten it out a little bit. Because I ain't doing nothing to it. It ain't going nowhere for me. But, you know, not bad. And if it don't work, I'll let Henry use it for Play-Doh. I always come up with something. I'll use it somehow. But, you know, for $1.79, not bad. Not bad. Alright. Oh, and I did get... Jeff a cup because I got me the pink one and I also went on there this one was got a deal on it five dollars and eight cents Stanley dupe just like that one it's a big one it's got the straw I was gonna say and it has the same lid as mine um and you know what guys I think my lid yeah it is cracked I think I might tell Timu See my, on my lid right there? I noticed that the other day when I was washing it. And, and I've not dropped it or anything. It had to be like that. And I just didn't notice it. See, because his is perfect. But um, I might tell them I got a cracked lid. Um, I mean, it's not that big of a deal. But, you know, I don't want a cracked lid. And I like this because you can put your straw in there. And when you're not using it, you can cover it like that. I think is really cool. Or if you're drinking out of it, you can drink like that. Or you could drink it like that. If you've got coffee or anything. But 50, what I say, 508. And I got him a black one because I always try to get him like black or gray or cause, I mean he really doesn't care, but he would not want to carry a peak. Yeah, now that I look at that, that crack is bothering me. It's not bad. Yeah, but it's cracked all the way. Eventually, eventually it'll. And you know what? That thing don't even want to turn easily. Yeah. I'm going to have to tell them about that. Because that, that is going to bother me. Um, okay. Then, I got these two signs. They were, these were the ones that were a little bent. I'm going to see if, I know people have been complaining about it. But, um, I got these for my brothers for, um, Christmas. Um, they were $4.48. This one is Fishing Tackle and Knowledge. It's just the, just the sign. And see how it's not sh not shaped right. We'll see if Jeff can maybe 
I don't know, set something heavy on it, get get it straightened out. Which I know these are hard to ship and everything. So I get it. I just wish, um, you know. And then I got Donnie the John Deere. And this one's really shaped bad. So, and it may not bother them. They may not even put them up. They might just, you know, like sit them up on a shelf in their barn or something. I don't know, but it's really out of shape. I'm gonna see if Jeff can maybe straighten it out. But, um, you know, I'm trying to think Christmas right now because the more I do now, the less I have to worry about later. Okay, and then I got some more buttons. These were Christmas ones. They've got Santa, Christmas tree. Do they have Rudolph? Yeah, they do have Rudolph. And then the snowman and candy canes. Yeah, they're really pretty. And then some bells. But um, yeah, and that size, that's a good size. That's a good size to put on clothing and hats and all kinds of stuff. You could decorate gloves with it. You can really do anything and everything with buttons. And those were, you got 50 pieces for $1.29. I didn't think that was bad. Okay, then I got, why do I feel like I'm missing something? I've got everything right here, but let me see that little coin thing. I do. Because I missed it on something. Huh, that's weird. Yeah, I don't know where, where what order it'd be in. Oh, well, okay, I'll just show it to you now. I got this little coin that says Armor of God, and it came with this order, but I don't find it on my order form. So, and if I remember correctly, it was probably, I don't know, a couple of dollars maybe, but it says Armor of God, and it comes in this really nice plastic thing. I don't know if you can take it out of the plastic or if it's in there. Oh, no, I think it's got a little groove here that you could take it off. I'm not going to take mine out. But um, it says, pray always, put on the whole armor of God. And then that's the other side. I don't know how well you can see it. I'm trying to keep it from glare. There's that, and then that's the whole armor. And it has the whole thing. It's got the helmet, the sword, the belt, sandals, shield. And what else? What's that? breastplate. I couldn't read it. I was like, they got it so crammed. So I was like, okay, what would be the other one? Breastplate. Okay. But that's really neat. I might go back and order me some more of these. These would be cute to put in cards, especially for someone that's, you know, that's needing some faith or, you know, just to give them a little bit more, you know, like, you know, keep praying. It'll be all right. It always is, you know, with God, you can't fail. So there's that. And I hate it because it wasn't on any of my papers. And that's so weird because this is the order that I ordered it. I don't know. Maybe if it was, came on a different one and maybe threw it away already. Let me just check one more time. Nope. Nope. I've got so much paper. I know. I don't mean to kill trees. You guys are going to be like, you're killing trees. You don't need to print all that paper off. I can't help it. I have to. Yeah, I can't find it. I don't know if it was on something else. I might have thrown it away. Oh, my eyes are itchy. The allergies are awful. Hold on. Oh, my eyes hurt. Okay, now I got this citrus juicer. I don't know if I'll use it, but I had to have it. Don't tell my husband that because I told him I would make him some fresh orange juice. He's not even here. Why am I whispering? <sighs> you know, because that's me, Amy. Amy's a little bit of everything. A uh, one-piece portable electric juicer, multifunction fruit juicer, household orange lemon blender. You can charge it. It has an automatic fresh squeezer. Nine dollars and forty-seven cents. Alrighty then, Timu. Let's open it up. It's like gonna be Christmas. It's almost like Christmas here every day when Timu comes. You got your charger. Wow, this is nice. What did it say for 10 bucks? I'm liking it. I got some apples over there. I might make some fresh apple juice. Hard telling. I might start a juice business. You never know. This is how it gets started, people. Don't laugh at me. This is how things get started. They're making grape juice. What the? Okay. Cut the fruit in half. Larger fruits can be cut into quarters. 
Pick grapes and put them in one by one. Cut watermelon into small pieces. They can juice all that. I'm gonna open me a little juice stand right here in my front yard. Yes, I am. And guys, they have nice instructions. So that's really good because I hate it when I get instructions and I don't know how to do something and I can't even read them. Okay, comes like this and I picked, oh, I was getting ready to say green, but this is called white. Look, there's a little thing. Don't tear it up, Amy. I get so excited. I'm like a little kid. You know, like you tell a kid, don't mess with that. You're going to tear it up. Okay. Um, you take the lid off. The lid off. There's your little juicer. So, you put that back on there. Don't take that off. No need to. Okay, so you would put your apple in here put the lid back on it push the button I didn't know if it was already charged up here's your thing to plug it in charge it up you know what would be nice you could take this camping you have it charged now oh wait does it charge you see sometimes I oh portable I just saw it portable electric juicer you could charge this up, go camping, have your oranges, your apples, and you'd have fresh juice. And there you go. And then this little thing pushes up like that, and your juice pours right out. Well, isn't that cute? I'm so glad I got this. And you just push your little button, and it probably squeezes it out. Yawn it. Talk like you could use all that fruit that they showed there. I mean, I guess anything you'd want. And just remember, if you do like, um, if you don't want to cut it like up and smaller, remember to put your, like, your fruit, you cut it in half, put that, put it down like that on top of that little thing so it can squeeze it out. I know you guys probably already know that, but I just wanted to throw that in there. Um, I was going to see if they have anything else. <coughs> on here that um and it just says cleaning it shows you how to do it that's so nice i'm glad i got that guys because i was kind of hesitant on that because i was like do i really want this and will it really work cool i might do a little video and a little review on that and we'll just get me some fresh apple juice okay there's a box for that then I got, oh, is this my last thing? Oh, it's so soft. Wait till you see it. It's not a shirt. It's not a towel. What could it be? What could it be? It was $9.98. Oh, it's so soft. Okay, I gotta sit up just a little bit more because I'm gonna have to show you this. It is so, so cute. It's a blanket. <laughs> and it's got my chickies on it. Look at this. Oh, I can't read backwards because I would read it to you. Just really like chickens, okay? Cute chickens. Can't stop love. Okay, that's the first one. And it's not very big, but I mean, it's big enough for me. It'd be like I could take it to a football game layover. It's kind of like a lap. And then love loves chickens. And then look at the middle chicken. Um, what's that one say? I really do need chickens. And I love the middle chick. What's she say? Chickens make me happy. <laughs> oh, that's adorable. I'm just going to keep going down. And then happy day. Look at all the baby chicks. Life is better with chickens. And then the bottom row. That's my chickens right here. Bar rock. And then there. Aw. Uh, I just love that, guys. It's just little things that make me so happy. Oh, happy day. Mama hen. Who loves chickens? That's me. I'm like a mother hen. Go messing with me and my family. I don't know why I did that. Okay, anyways. That was $9.48. I just love that. I'm going to put that in the wash. 
just oh and it's so soft I don't know if you guys can see how soft that is let's show you this over here but I mean that's just like the softest material ah I love it I was gonna see what it it don't have I don't think it had any tags on it because I was gonna see if it did I was gonna and it's well stitched I mean huh no let me see if it says on my paper where to go uh, nope it does not say it does say it's 39 by 59 inches yep it doesn't say ah uh, it's so cute I love it ah uh, ah uh, so cute all right guys that is the end of my haul and so now I'm probably gonna go do laundry um finish up the house a little bit jace's got a ball game tonight we'll be playing some football who's ready for some football i ordered me some football earrings and his collars are oh i was gonna say what's on my hand um his collars are um red red blue and white and um i uh wanted my earrings for tonight but i don't have them i got some from last year but i just wanted my newer ones but anyways that's about it um, I'm still working on a nail video. Don't think I forgot about you. I've just been canning and cleaning and now we're starting football. This is the way it is. It's like once I get done with one thing, then we get right back into another thing. So, and I got my Timu shirt on. Um, I think it says, don't worry, be happy. And now I got that. I put that blanket up against me. These shirts, this was a shirt that I didn't think I liked the material, guys. And it's not that bad. And it's really hot and humid outside. But it feels really good. It's not that bad at all. It's really soft. And I like it better than what I thought I would. But, um, yeah. I guess that's about it. I've showed you everything. And now let me go drink my frozen water. I got water in there, but I can't get to it. Mm. So nice and cold. Not complaining, but <laughs> I guess I got to learn to put my straw in first, then my ice. <laughs> That's so funny. All right, guys, I'm out of here. Remember, sprinkle some smiles. Put a smile on your face. Put a smile on somebody else's face and make it a good day for both of you. Because that's what it's all about. You know, there's too much grievance and sadness and heartache and anger in the world. Let's put a, you know, let's just sprinkle some smiles and make it a good day. All right, I'm off my rant. <laughs> all right, guys. Love y'all. God bless. And thank you for all the comments that you've been sending and all the subscribers. Thank you for subscribing. You're making this channel just more than what I thought it could be. I just got in on here for fun and it's turned into something more. So I appreciate that. All right. Thanks a lot. God bless and have a good day and a good weekend. Bye y'all.